Hello Gators, welcome to another edition of GNN. I'm London Gaskin. And I'm Morgan Wallace. Today is Monday, October 2nd, and here are your top stories. Calling all FBLA members who have paid their dues, the fall rally will be taking place November 3rd. Here's a video from FBLA with more information about the event. Hi, my name is Julianne Taylor, the president of FBLA. Future Business Leaders of America will be hosting their annual fall rally event Friday, November 3rd. The FBLA Fall Rally for District 20 is a wonderful opportunity and event that district members look forward to each year. Members will experience a business conference firsthand, hear a keynote speaker, and attend business breakout sessions, participate in chapter conversations such as t-shirt flyer and display of board design, and battle the tattoo chapters versus middle school high and high school. Students will also enjoy a banquet style catered luncheon. The cost to attend is $35 and permission slips are required and must be returned by September 28th with a $35 payment. You can also make your payment on school cash online but you must show proof. This event is for paid FBLA members only. If you have paid your business managed dues that does include your FBLA membership. You can see Ms. Collier in room 3122 if you have any questions or to make a payment. You won't want to miss out on this great event. FBLA will be given an extension to turn in your form and money to October 5th. Remember, the fall rally is, is for paid FBLA members only. You can also turn in your dues with your fall rally form. Make sure to pay your FBLA dues and turn in your money and application for fall rally to room 3122. Calling all boys soccer players. Official tryouts will begin next week. Junior varsity players or 9th, 10th, and 11th graders go to the stadium field and bring full gear along with your completed sports physical on Monday, October 2nd, and Tuesday, October 3rd. Varsity players or 11th and 12th graders will meet at the stadium field after school Wednesday, October 4th, and Thursday, October 5th. For more information, go to Coach McIntyre's office. The room number is 3124, or join the team Instagram page by scanning the QR code you see on the screen. Girls JV soccer shots will be held on October 9th and 10th at the school. See Coach Call Nun in room 3125 for more information. If you are a coder and want to meet other coders and code together, maybe you want to learn how to code or you want to enter coding competitions and help the coding club with creating a banner. Perhaps you just want to see what coding is all about. Then you should come to room 3211 every Wednesday after school and check out the coding club. The Creative Photography Club will meet today, right after school in room 3211. Come and bring your friends, the more the merrier. The Math Honor Society's first general meeting will take place on Thursday, October 5th in room 3211. If you haven't applied yet, there are still applications available. You can fill them out at the meeting, come and bring your friends with you. The school counseling department is currently scheduling colleges to visit our campus. If you are a junior or senior and would like to attend any of these visits, go to the school counseling department and sign up with the, guide with the guidance secretary. The deadline to sign up is the day before each visit at 3 p.m. Here is the list of colleges visiting this month. Florida State University will be here on October 9th at 9.30 a.m. The University of Florida will be here on October 10th at 8.30 a.m. Florida A&M University will be here October 12th at 1.30 p.m. Florida Memorial University will be here on October 17th at 9.30 a.m. Florida Gulf Coast University on October 19th at 1.30 p.m. Nova Southeastern University on October 20th at 1.30 p.m. Florida Polytechnic University on October 30, 30th at 9.30 a.m. And now let's check out weather with Alex. Thanks, Morgan. I'm Alex Asal, and this is your GNN 5-day weather forecast. The rain that came down all weekend will continue today as we will see a 100% chance of off and on showers. Our highs will reach 84 degrees and our lows will be in the, mid, in the upper 70s. For tomorrow and the remainder of the week, the rain goes away and we will see partly sunny conditions. Highs will reach the mid to upper 80s and lows will be in the mid 70s. That's it for your GNN weather. Let's head back to our anchors. Thanks, Alex. Are you in need of formal wear for any reason? Homecoming, prom, graduation? Maybe you have been invited to a wedding or perhaps I have a religious service to attend. If you or someone you know is in need of formal wear for any reason, please stop by Mrs. Evans' room in room 1208 to check out the beautiful dresses and handsome suits. There is something for everyone and it's all for free. Stop by room 1208 anytime. 
Do you need help with some of your classes? We now have after school tutorials for math, English, history, science, and more. Tutorials will be held in the media center after school from 3 p.m. to 5 p.m. Activity bus passes are available. Yearbooks are on sale. You can purchase yours for $85 at balfour.com. Prices will be going up on November 1st, so don't delay. Students are invited to join the Google Classroom for their grade level. Click on the Google Classroom tile in your school district portal and click Join to Add. Students can find community service information, scholarship info, internship information, and more. If you have any questions, email your school counselor. Looking for community service hours? If so, you can donate old or new sneakers to Coach Carr in room 2113. You will receive two hours for each pair you donate. And now, let's see what's going on in sports with Ivan. Thanks, London. I'm Ivan Kursak, and this is your GNN Sports Report. Our varsity football team's away game against the Rams of Palm Beach Lakes was canceled Friday night due to weather. The game has been rescheduled for tonight at 5 o'clock. Our girls' volleyball teams have away games tonight against Olympic Heights. The freshman team starts at 5, followed by the JV team at 6, and then the varsity team at 7. And our swim and dive team has a dual meet today against Santa Lucia's starting at 4.30. That's it for your GNN Sports Report. Let's head back to our anchors. Thanks, Ivan. Well, that's it for today, Gators. Tune in tomorrow for another edition of GNN. For Alex Asau and Ivan Kursak, I'm Morgan Wallace. And I'm London Gaskin. And, and remember, remember, don't just be a Gator, be a greater Gator. Have, have a great, great day. day.